Tashigal, my name is Raj Singh Pandal. I was born in Ludhiana, Punjab. In the 1990s, I moved to Canada and currently live in Fraser Valley. From a young age, I have had a passion for collecting marbles and kites. Then came 1984, where we lost the Sikh reference library. As we were still trying to comprehend the loss, many years passed before we understood the significance of what was taken. What happened there was unbelievable, unimaginable, unforgettable, and unforgivable. I then started to bring together artifacts from around the world. This included many visits to auction houses, used bookstores, and various museums, all which made me awestruck by the work that is done by others. By the grace of Waheguru, our team has been privileged to be the holders of invaluable artifacts that span from early 1600s to date. Included within our collection is a Serblo Simrini from 1800s, a first edition book signed by Maharaja Dilip Singh, a first edition of military memoirs of Mr. Thomas by William Franklin, and the unpublished war records of the 47 sex. Our vision remained to preserve, learn, and share artifacts relating directly and indirectly to the Sikh civilization. At the same time, we aim to be the catalyst to inspire others to preserve items in their possession. Currently, we are hosting an online museum with a future plan to open a physical museum on the West Coast. We hope to share the artifacts in our possession unapologetically from a Sikh perspective. I would say that first and foremost, may he bless us with a clear understanding of living in his hukam. We should try our best to accept the parna at the end. I do not claim to be, nor I am a formally educated. I hope that my journey to date is proof that irrespective of a formal education, we can all continue to learn and share with one another. Through the sheer will of individuals, we can maintain our present while ensuring that we never forget our past. I'm reminded of a quote that is very dear to me. The struggle of man against power is the struggle of memory against forgetting.